Hey guys, how's it going? Now with Windows 11, there are a lot of things that are customizable. And one of those things is the taskbar itself. We've already done a video talking about how to change the size of the taskbar icons in Windows 11. However, today I have another cool trick for you. Suppose you have a really cool wallpaper, but the taskbar only works in accents and that kind of spoils the look. Sure, you can hide the taskbar altogether, but that's not really convenient. I'll tell you a better way in which you can actually make the taskbar transparent. So without wasting any time, this is Warren from Guiding Tech and let's get started. Okay, so the whole process is actually super simple. First, head over to the Microsoft Store and search for Translucent TB. I'll also leave a direct link to it down there in the description box. Download and install it on your system. Once you're done, click on Launch and you'll be greeted with a pop-up message, which you can pretty much ignore. Now, if you notice, your taskbar should already be transparent. But that's not all. Open the quick launch tray and right click on the taskbar icon to access its settings and play around with them to see what works best for you. For instance, depending upon your wallpaper, you might want to change the transparency settings from clear to acrylic or opaque. Also, you can modify it to be clear on the desktop but switch to opaque or acrylic when an application window is opened up. Now, this ensures that your productivity is not affected when you have an app open. But the moment you minimize things and open the desktop, the taskbar switches to being transparent and looks super cool. There's also an option to customize the taskbar when the laptop switches to the battery saver profile. Now, in that kind of a scenario, I prefer changing the profile to accent color of red. That way, the moment I'm running low on battery, my taskbar changes the color to red. Lastly, if you've tweaked around a lot and just want to revert all the changes, just right click on the icon, go to advanced and then click on return to default settings. And that should bring back everything to square one. And well, that was it. As always, you can find the download link to the app that I talked about down there in the description box. If you found this video helpful, make sure to let us know by giving us a thumbs up and subscribing to our channel for more awesome tech content. We also have a ton of other videos around Windows 11 that you can check out from the links down there in the description box. One video that I would strongly recommend is how to fix the drag and drop feature for the Windows 11 taskbar. So yeah, make sure to check that one out. Till then, this is one from Guiding Tech and I'll see you in the next one.